China is one of uh, the top markets for American exports. Uh, we're now exporting more than $100 billion a year in goods and services to China, and that supports about half a million uh, American jobs from manufacturing to agriculture. Uh, and in fact, our exports to China are growing nearly twice as fast as our exports to the rest of the world. Uh, of course, here in the United States, we've got one of the most open economies in the world, and that makes us a top destination for Chinese exports, uh, but also Chinese investment. Uh, it, it is important, I think, to note that uh, even with China's enormous population, uh, the United States still does more trade with Europe than it does with China. That, I think, gives an indication of the amount of progress that can be made uh, if uh, we are consulting with each other, if we are hearing specifically from businesses in terms of how we can uh, ease uh, some of the uh, frictions that exist in our trading relationship. Uh, and so my hope is that today, in the brief time that we have, we'll be able to hear some concrete ideas uh, about uh, how we make sure that fair, uh, the trade is fair, uh, that there is a level playing field, uh, how can we protect intellectual property, how can we promote innovation, uh, how can uh, both of our governments uh, remove barriers to trade uh, and barriers to job creation. Uh, and with China's growing middle class, I believe that over the coming years, we can more than double our exports uh, to China and create more jobs here in the United States. Uh, and I'm sure that Chinese business leaders see enormous opportunities uh, here as well.